alert forecast. Well, as I mentioned earlier, it's a little dry around the metro. We could certainly use a little bit of rain. And uh, here's the way the climatology shapes up for the metro. We haven't had much so far this month. And since March 1st, we've got about a two inch deficit for the year. We're down almost two inches. So a little rain would be helpful. And it looks like we'll be seeing some of that but it's going to take a while. And I'll explain to that in just a little bit. We have a very slow moving weather pattern that's uh, beginning to take shape. The rain will come, but it may uh, hold off mainly till next week, at least any meaningful rain I'm talking about. Currently outside, it's 65 degrees. We have a south-southeast wind at 16 miles an hour. Visibilities at 10 miles. For a time this morning, they were down to two. We hope we uh, don't see that again tomorrow. Around the neighborhood, Lakeshore at 62 degrees. It is 63 in Elkhorn, 61 in Chalco Hills. 62 degrees out in the field club area. And uh, in terms of temperatures region-wide, We've dropped into the 50s around Carroll and Denison up in uh, northern Iowa, but most locations are in the low and middle 60s across our viewing area, especially to the uh, west of the river. As we take a look at the uh, satellite radar, what you're seeing there is ground clever. All is quiet, mainly clear skies out there, a few high clouds out in western Nebraska. That's where the precipitation is in the high plains of Wyoming in the form of some snow and some rain. And the reason for that is we have a storm system that's sitting out here in the Pacific Northwest, and that is going to be digging southward. And then that's about as far as it's going to go for a while. We'll set this into motion now. Very slow moving pattern. This high is going to be parked here, keeping that storm system to uh, our west and allowing a lot of the precipitation to lift right into western Kansas and into western Nebraska, along with some snow from the panhandle westward into sections of uh, Denver. And you can see it's going to be a while before we can see some of the rain here in the metro as we take a look at future cast through Saturday. Again, Norfolk, Columbus, Lincoln could see a little bit, uh, maybe a sprinkle or two on the day of the game, but I don't think we'll see much of anything, at least for here, in terms of uh, four. Tomorrow's temperatures will be dropping uh, into the lower 50s. If you have some lunchtime plans, you have some errands to run, uh, readings will be in the upper 60s and lower 70s. We're going to make a pretty good run tomorrow afternoon. Few clouds, high level clouds, but it's going to be a warm day tomorrow and a breezy one. 54 for the low tonight. Could see some hazy skies again tomorrow morning. Highs tomorrow will make a run at 80 degrees. Looks like a pretty decent day. A little bit breezy. And then on Saturday and Sunday, 73 degrees. Chances for sprinkles here in the metro area. More meaningful rain comes next week. The models are indicating that storm system may begin to kick out of there. And so we've got a good chance of rain, particularly on Tuesday, with chances for